It's that time of year again here at Cal State Fullerton. It's Battle of the Buildings. During this time, residents take on other residents from different buildings with activities such as billiards, Mario Kart races, volleyball, and basketball games. This three-day event is sponsored by the Resident Student Association and the Associated Students Incorporated, who have joined with Kai Sci Fi this year to plan the games. There are three different buildings in each team, with four teams in total for the event. Each team proudly represents their buildings by chanting their own creative cheers. Here is PBS. <laughs> Weho Juma Let's go to the day one of the event. Day one buildings competed in a pool game. Spelling Bee Competition, Mario Kart and Capture the Flag. Wehojima took home the prize for pool and the Spelling Bee. PBS was announced Mario Kart champions and CFO was crowned winners for Capture the Flag. Day 2 takes on another full day of games consisting of ping pong, scavenger hunt and pumpkin pie eating contests. But for people who rather not stuff their faces in food, they're using their skills for a more mentally challenging activity. And now Genevieve Momon has the latest of what's happening on day three of Battle of the Buildings. Red Team, Team Avenue, was the champions of both the volleyball games and the five-on-five -five basketball games. The final day of Battle of the Buildings events included relay races and dodgeball. The weekend allowed people with lots of different interests to participate and represent their teams. The fun-filled weekend ended with a closing ceremony where the teams gathered together to celebrate the end of this year's battles. Team Avenue is the ultimate winner at the weekend's games. Reporting from the Cal State Fullerton dorms, this is Genevieve Momot and Tanya Alwi. Good job, good job. Good job.